Hi guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Njeri and as always, this is The Limitless Show. Welcome to today's episode. I'll be taking you through my self-care day. So I'm going to start by taking a nice long shower. The product I'm going to start with is the Imperial Retha Intense Cool Bath. I love products for men and this soap is for men but I do love how this product smells and also the cooling sensation it leaves on my body and also as you can see I am using my exfoliating gloves where this is in Osham Pakadambi so the next product that I'm going to use is the Sidoso shower gel also it's a men's product as I said earlier I usually love how men products smell but now you can tell like I have a, an obsession for men products so this shower gel hey shower gel this shower gel is amazing and it smells heavenly it's affordable so yeah another thing with this shower gel is that it lathers very very well the next product that i'm going to be using is the rubiella kojic soap this soap um i have been using it for quite some time i do have hyperpigmentation and i have been using this soap to collect that and uh, yeah, so the next product that I am going to use is the Dr. Mene, Dr. Mene, I hope I'm saying it right, Dr. Mene Body Club. And honestly, I don't really love the way this product smells, but on a rate of 1 to 10, I give it a 6 because it leaves your body so moisturized and smooth, especially if you're using the exfoliating gloves, your body will feel so, so smooth like a baby. And definitely that is the, that is the reason why I keep restocking it. That is what I usually do on a daily basis. And so that is it for the products of my shower routine. And now on to my skincare. I start by brushing my teeth. And I have been trying these, um, what do you call it, toothpaste. I've been trying this toothpaste for some time. Uh, I had just diverted from the normal, what we have called Get Close Up. And I wanted to try something new. And uh, this is the Double Herbal. And I have been really loving it. I'm going to be washing my face and I am going to be using the Garnier Skin Active 3 in 1. If you have been here for some time, uh, the other skincare routine, and if you've not watched it, I'm going to leave the link below so that you can watch it and see what has changed since the last time I did my skincare uh, routine. So um, you, you'll notice that I have been using the Garnier Skin Active for quite some time because it's a nice product. The Garnier Skin Active 3 in 1 Charcoal it's a mask wash and scrub product but today i'm just going to use the wash and scrub because i'm not going to mask so i'm going to start by washing and scrubbing my face and i'm also going to be using the um, exfoliating gloves again but on this because it's your face you should be so gentle because they tend to be a little bit brittle so you should be very very gentle when using the exfoliating crust but it does a really good job in cleaning uh, in washing your face and scrubbing it especially with the three-in-one gunny skin active it's going to give your your skin an even tone and it also like fades the dark spot on your face by the end of this uh, skincare routine you are going to realize that my skincare is all um, about all my main goal is to have a spotless skin and uh, well moisturized and zero sun damage so after the gunny skin active three in one I, i'm going to go in with my rose water and i'm just going to splash it on my face I'm going to go in with my Garnier Vitamin C Serum and this is the Even and Matte and another thing I have another serum so if I'm not using the Garnier one I usually use the Dr. Rachel one so it's I, I just keep on oscillating uh, from both of them and I also have another eye serum this is for when I wake up with puffy eyes or I just want to keep the area under my eye very moisturized because in most products 
you find like when you're doing the skincare under the eye there are not so many products for under the eye so i usually use the dr rachel eye serum for that but in this video i haven't used it but just to mention After the Ghani vitamin, uh, vitamin C serum, I am going to apply the Ghani protective cream. It is also even in matte. Uh, it itself protects against the sun because it has SPF 30. And for this, uh, for this cream, I am going to apply by massaging it to my skin. Also, if you have noted, I usually massage my skin a lot my face a lot that is um so it is a very nice product also because it protects and it moisturizes it keeps your skin moisturized very well For today's uh, video, the last product that I'm going to use is the Dr. Rachel Anti-Aging 60 SPF Moisture Sun Cream. Guys, uh, this product is gold. Firstly, it moisturizes your skin, smells amazing, and protects it against the sun damage. As I've said, it's a 60 SPF. It doesn't leave a white cast. And also, you can see on the video, it absorbs in skin really quickly and nicely. I love, love, love it. So, yeah, that is it for my skincare routine. And guys, it is very important to have a routine because your skin is going to thank you. Another thing that I wanted to let you know is that um, because since it's pamper day, I didn't mention, I usually use the Nivea Repair and Care Body Lotion. I also use, because I'm doing this uh, routine on the evening, so I usually, uh, the deodorant I use is the, the Treaty Touch by Luron. And uh, another thing, I usually use Vaseline for my lips. As always, if you have been here for long, you know that I use Vaseline for my lips. And uh, the perfume that I usually use if it's on during the day um, is Promise by Sapil. And uh, the body brush I use, this one I use during the night. After shower, after the skincare routine, after the shower routine, I usually do the Dior and the body brush so that you have to smell amazing. And as I said, this is a very affordable pamper routine okay, so guys that is it for today's video until next time kindly subscribe comment share and we are growing let's get to 1000 subscribers by the end of this year